Hello. Oh, of course. My phone starts buzzing as soon as I start. That's awkward. Um, give me a second to set up. Uh, hello, everyone. Um, <laughs> I just got a text because my brother and his friends are making s'mores. And I was like, you know what? You guys are taking way too long. Just tell me when you're making s'mores. And I'll, I'll figure it out. That text right now? That text was for that, so I'm literally going to tell them to make me a s'more and then I will just go on a very quick break. I will go on a very quick break to get a s'more. Um, oh, of course my little guy isn't be bouncing. There we go. Or not. It says I'm connected. Wait, I know what it is. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. Ah, shit. I didn't figure out what was wrong with my chat box last time. We'll figure that out one day. We will figure that out. I will- I would be happy to give people s'mores. Come get a s'more. Come get a s'more. It'll be fun. It'll be really fun. Um, but yeah, I might have to briefly go on- on- just like BRB. Grab a s'more. Because I want a s'more. Here's my center of operations. Not my see. desk. Go ahead and walk um, around. I forgot to say hi. Hello, Ronnie. Hello, JJ. Hello, Elliot. And hello, Cynthia. How are all of you guys? And be sure to check out my scrapbook. Nancy. <laughs> from all my past I know. Cases in there. A lot of them um, were pretty dangerous. In a I, I know, girl. I know. Um, I hope if you're in the United States that um, the fireworks aren't too annoying. So... Uh, you know, um, your new job is the worst. I'm sorry, Elliot. That sucks. I, I hope that it becomes more tolerable. And the village was busy today. That's awesome. I'm always happy to hear that the village is doing all right. Sometimes I worry about the village. I drive past it and I'm like, I hope the things are okay in there. <laughs> Need to go vote in your building. Um, let me text my brother real quick and just be like, um, can you make me one? <laughs> Can you make me one? Uh, other- don't worry, I'll drag you in the village. Sounds good to me, honestly. I am currently not doing anything with my life because I am waiting for an interview. I have currently not gotten a call back. I was told I will be contacted for- what does it say? Hold on. I have it next to me. It says, um, based on the above results, you will be contacted by a representative from the department who will schedule you for an interview. And this was on June 22nd. So I actually have to call tomorrow um, and be like, hey, I didn't miss that, did I? Because that would be uh, bad and embarrassing. Sorry, I had to click to make sure something was working. Okay, cool. Uh, yes, the department. TM, TM, TM. And you already know how I'm doing, but it's going good. You're also waiting for me. Important. True. True. Joining one of those secret organizations. Not a secret organization so much as attempting to join a library, but, like, with everything involved, something it else. feels a bit I'll like joining a secret society or something. Like, goodness. There's a lot going on in here. Also, um, I forgot how small the text is. Again, apologies. I can't figure out how to make it any bigger. Can't check that off yet. Can't check that off yet. Still have to do that. Mm-hmm. Check. Oh, wonderful. Um, Still have to do that. Okay. Uh, the forbidden stacks. Yeah, check that off they yet. sure are forbidden. A lot of people want to get library page jobs. And there are not that many. It's very difficult to get one. Um, but I want to get one before I decide, yes, I want to go to school for... Okay, I'm going to keep bye, Edward. Um, before going for my master's, but like, fuck. Am I right? Um, the stacks are forbidden and it makes me so angry. Like, stop forbidding them. Let me in. Um, I don't think I've played this Nancy Drew game. Yeah, I was- it was recommended that I play this one next, and it's definitely- it's weird. It's- it's- it's one of the weirder Nancy ones. The puzzles, they give you a lot fewer hints. They've given me a lot less help in this game. I- 
didn't need much assistance last time. Nope, wrong key. Um, to get through, like, the, the Rue Goldberg machine and everything, and oh my god. Um, but have they considered that you deserve one more? <laughs> I wish that jobs were based on deserving. I, I, I'm like, I have so much to tell people. Let me, let me give people books. And, like, every place I've been that's like, we sell books, we give away books, we're a library, nothing. Nightmare. Uh, I just finished my master's in library science and cannot find a job. Oh, I'm sorry, Elliot. That sucks. Job hunting is so hard. It's so hard. I don't... What else do you want from me, game? I think I felt a little stuck last time, too. Which isn't good. That doesn't bode well for me. Do I have to call people? Let's just click through. We called this Hotchkiss last time, I think. Nancy, how's it going? Pretty good. Meaning... Med moment! I don't want to go back to work tomorrow, I'm gonna die packing chocolate. Ronnie, you already know you can't die packing chocolate. Because you have to come visit me. And I gotta go to bed, but text me a time we can hang, hope you've been well. Oh, I absolutely will! Um, now that I'm done with work, I have a lot more time until I find a job. So I, I'll let you know. Uh, sleep well, and I hope that tomorrow is good for you. I'll talk to you later. Bye! With the legend of the <laughs> I'm, I, the skulls? way all this information yeah, left my brain. Supposedly scattered a bunch of perfectly formed crystal skulls all around the world like thousands of years ago. That's and insane. All the skulls <laughs> have different magical powers? Something like that, yeah. Apparently Henry's uncle was the proud owner of the Whisperer, the skull that was supposed to make whoever owned it live forever. Only now he's dead and another superstition bites the dust. Maybe, maybe not. See, this book I found in Bruno's library said no one who has owned the Whisperer has ever died of natural causes. Ooh. So how did they die? They were all murdered. They were all murdered. Don't that crystal all right, stuff cool. is true, do you? <laughs> Carter hasn't read my text message. I'm going to be so annoyed if they do not make me a s'more. I want a s'more so bad. Um, like, this is a good, like, is this a good summer job for a few months? Yes. Am I going to have enough money for getting a bunny slash school? Oh, definitely. And then some since I work six days a week, but like, I'm tired and I've looked the same Glass Animals album for like over four, 24 hours and I'm a shell and there's weeks to go job venting in the Taya chat. So no, don't apologize. It's fine. I don't mind. I get it though. Sometimes you just, um, sure you're just tired. But, right like, now, at least you're I making that money so you don't have to worry about it during the school year, I guess? Them, that 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 might, power. like, they it sucks now, but, like, when you're, like, at school dead. and have your bunny, I'm sure you'll be like, you know what, this was worth it. Well, there you go. Natural Job hunting my absolute beloved. I feel like I have a lot of, like, skills, but that no one gives a shit. Like, that's what it feels like. Because everybody's looking for a job always, so it feels like no one gives a shit. Um, it's fine. I haven't gotten around to asking him about it yet. Girl, that's because it's not an option in the dialogue. Um, for sure, especially since I can def only do the schedule I did last year at Brush Craze, which sucks because that's the job I'd rather do six days a week. But class, school, yeah. I def only be able to work weekends. Yeah, no, and. I mean, that's fine. You don't have to work a lot during the, during the semester, but I totally get it. Just, like, saving up. I actually, I'm glad I didn't spend my last few paychecks yet from my other job, because when I was doing my spreadsheet the other day, like, two or three zines I want are going into pre-orders very soon. Like, very soon. And I'm just standing here, like, I don't have income. Ah! I miss being in school. That sweet student loan money was the greatest. I just... I I, I wish I were in school, but like in the, the school in my brain. <laughs> if that makes sense. I want the school that exists in my brain and not like the school experience I had, which wasn't... Oof. Um, I'll buy you bubble tea when I'm up there. We can go to a mall, as is our tradition. Cool. I will bring you to the Natick Mall or the... Hmm... I, probably the Natick Mall. Um, 
It's like 45 minutes, but they have the best stuff, so eh. Um, but we do have to go to the mall. Uh, same on the upcoming zines to Asuriu zine. I am thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it, and I'm perceiving it, and I'm seeing it. <laughs> I'm seeing it in my brain. want it in my hands. I got that, um, god, I need to find the name now. Hold on. This is Dr. Gilbert Buford's answering service. Oh, my uh zine shelf is right behind me i got um i got i bought like event horizon like the actual copy like the book copy um by marcia it's the prettiest shit i've ever seen it made me like when i was flipping through it like i was going through a whole like personal crisis <laughs> like do you ever see something really pretty and then you have like a crisis about yourself as a creator that's what happened they're having a conversation that i'm just not paying attention to which worst way to play a video game ever but it's fine do that have an arcade or something i do not know i will have to check i don't remember we don't have like a i'm kind of in the middle of nowhere dude <laughs> Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome, man. I've always wanted to try gumbo. One day I'll get to try gumbo. <laughs> Me and Disco when people are talking and you're spamming your way out of there and I'm busy looking at Kim. Oh, uh, okay. Um, let's see. I'm not sure if that solved anything for me. Sometimes you have to make calls, but I know, but I don't know what I haven't explored in the garden. Did I? Well, I will not tell you who this is, but I have a writing friend who went on a little bit of a retreat this weekend, and they happened to meet one of the people who wrote Nancy Drew in the 80s and 90s and learned a bunch of information about, like, how they write them and stuff. You later. The mm -hmm. way I'm the... I'm so fucking jealous. I have questions for you, you fucking hockey puck. I'm going to keep I want to ask you about the skull. Oh my god. Oh, this is a nightmare. Whatever. Do you have anything okay. to say? I'll Shit. See you later. Come see me anytime. Hockey puck, yeah. Might be getting called. If I'm getting called. That is the greatest insult. <laughs> my second hockey puck of the day. Listen. I'm just, I just, I picked it up from, like, I think Jaden Animations, actually, like, nice talking to you. in one of the videos, I think anytime. she called, like, her classmates, like, hockey pucks or something, and I picked it up, and I just haven't changed since. I was like, that's perfect, and then I, yeah, yeah, Jaden, I think that I just stuck with that. Okay, one second. Sorry, I had to talk to my mom. Someone is going to bring me a s'more, and when I do that, I will mute and, like, turn on music for a second or something while I eat a s'more. Um. <laughs> it took them, like, an hour or something. Oh, Ronnie, you'll be thrilled to know this, but, um... When I was talking to my mom about you coming up, I was like, oh yeah, so Ronnie's gonna visit on this day. That's when Ronnie's coming up. And my mom goes, Ronnie? Oh, I told Maya about that. Uh, Maya's best friend, right? <laughs> and I was like, that's what, that's what, oh, shit. Okay. What just happened? Fuck, am I about to die? No? Okay, that was scary. <laughs> Let me save. I haven't saved yet today. Save. Hello? Uh... <laughs> uh... What did I- what do you mean, what did I say? I- I got distracted by thinking I was about to die. I'm sorry. There's got to be an order to this, but I don't know what it is. Oh, 
Oh, uh, I, I, I was just, oh, oh shit. Oh, uh, okay. Um, I, I think I just told her, um, I think I just, like, explained it. Like, why Maya said that. I think that's what I did. So do they all have to stand up? This is so annoyingly slow. Maybe I should leave. Um, did that explore every inch of the Still garden? Have to do that. Damn it. Okay. Still have to do that. Still have to do that. I genuinely am not entirely sure what I should be doing now. Um, observations. Scroll to the bottom. Hmm. Hmm. I already went inside the crypt, and I don't know what this means yet. We already did Zeke stuff. Jeez. Like, what? Uh, maybe I do need them to hold my hand more. I know we talked about this last week, but I... Maybe I can go ask about that. Hello again. Nope, not with you. Fare the well. Okay. Hey, weirdo. Yes. Ugh. I'll check back with you later. Whatever. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Again, nothing I can click here right now. Um.
just didn't have anything to do like one of the times I tried to become her. Um, this game is weird in that way where you can become Vess. Um, was it a good s'more? It was good. I mean, it's a s'more. So, it was pretty good. I will say, uh, the graham crackers, the top and bottom were not even. That bothered me a little bit. <laughs> no, it wasn't a big deal. It was a good s'more and I like wasn't there to make it myself. So, um, all things considered, pretty good. So let's make a phone call. I don't think I ever called the cab company. I don't know why I have to. It said to call the cab company. I just didn't. I don't know. Due to current weather and road conditions, cab service to the greater New Orleans area has been temporarily suspended. Why did you make me call them? Can we make s'mores when I'm there or something? Sure, why not? I would love to. Oh, this is our YouTube arc then? Okay, here's this. If I have a job and you're home all day, you can be in charge of slowly uploading 87 VODs to my YouTube channel. How's that sound? Hello? Hi, Bess. It's me. So what's been happening? We become oh, Bess. Well, let's see. Since the last time we talked, I was just about... <laughs> Such a funny way to transition interesting stuff but the reason I call what if i sneak I videos of things you hate you onto your channel i guess that's something i'd have to deal with it then with like it <sighs> whatever i think you know exactly shut up shut up shut your entire face shut up shut up no black ops stuff he was Bruno Bollet's doctor, and apparently his best friend. Though I did too. figure out I how to directly upload VODs from Twitch, so I don't have to download them. Um, once I get all of mine set up, um, all, once I upload my entire backlog, I'll have to just do that. So I don't have to keep killing my hard drive. Great, I'm gonna be chatting up Jack the Ripper. Oh, I'm sure the guy's fine, but... I have to rename them all, which means I have to watch them all because I hadn't been naming them because I had to download like a ton at once and then put them in the folder. So I have to like figure out what order to even upload them in, which is going to be a little nightmarish. At least for disco. Um, it should be fine, but. Why, hello, young lady. How kind of you to grace an old man with your lovely presence. This guy looks even worse than some of the other ones. Like, um, model-wise. Like, this animation... Like, this model's not fantastic. The eyes aren't great, and he looks especially plasticky. Your answering service said I'd probably find you here. This here is my favorite spot in the whole city. Delicious gumbo... This looks like it's just a ba uh, uh, like a bowl of, like, unshelled shrimp. <laughs> I'd like to ask you some questions. Doesn't it look like just a bowl of unshelled shrimp? I prefer subject matter of a happier nature, but I do not want to seem inhospitable, so... Bess really just came up to this guy and was like, so the guy who died. Can we talk about the guy who died? He looks very plastic, yes. Hmm, this man, I bet, is the real murderer. I don't know what crime happened. I think it looks like crayfish? Oh, maybe. Is it a bowl of just crayfish? I don't know if that's any better. Bruno was just the opposite. You act like you've never eaten unshelled shrimp with a man made out of plastic. I can't say I have. Unfortunately, that's a fundamental experience I haven't gotten yet. Um. So, um, JJ, we basically, so the plot of this one is a little bit weird. So, Bess and I were just, I believe, coming down to New Orleans for, like, a vacation. And Ned's friend from school, Henry, his grandfather just died. Or uncle? Grand one of his family members just died. And Ned thought he was, was worried about him. And so he wanted us to check up on him and we come to the house and there's this weird spooky guy who like blow throws like flour or blows it or some sort of powder stuff on it and vanishes and nancy's like well now i have to figure out what's going on but also like henry and ned aren't friends so like ned just asked his girlfriend to look up uh, like check up on this guy who like he doesn't really know at all Really weird move, Ned. Like, the setup to this one isn't great. Um, and then there's, supposedly, the guy who died had a crystal skull that's supposed to, like, 
had a no 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 had a skull <laughs> he had a skull called the whisperer and everyone who's ever owned it like has been murdered so his death must be a murder i think it's a crystal skull one of them is i think supposed to make me make you immortal i does it really matter but yes just like toy story <laughs> just like toy story um did dr Bollet ever say anything to you also we can act as best which is really fun and different and yes, not a thing in the other games fact, we can just call best and become best Said owning it was gonna there we go to live forever i thought it was utter nonsense and told him so well he didn't appreciate that oh. at all thank Reduced you ronnie i am taking a drink now weeks. you can redeem yourself Uh, that's really cool. You can mind meld with Bess. Awesome. Yeah, you just like switch places and play as her. It, no other Nancy games that I've played and that the person who was here last week who like knew a lot about both this game and Nancy Drew um, have seen it in other games. They did say that there is one other game where you can play another character, but it's just for a single scene versus this one where we can keep coming back to Bess and we've actually had to be her, I think, two or three times now. I think this is the third time we've needed to be her to continue the plot. Since Henry said that you were pretty much Bruno's only friend, maybe Bruno had said something to you about it, and as it turns out, he had. That's all I know. I see. Well, much as I'd like to believe that skull holds the key to immortality, I'm afraid Bruno's passing proves it's worthless. Although it would make an attractive paperweight, as I recall. What if it's plastic? That would be a little bit funny, right? That'd be a little uh, tiny bit funny if it were plastic. Advanced age and the absence of any indication of foul play, an autopsy was deemed unnecessary, and the body was cremated according to Bruno's wishes. Um, Doctor Belay's housekeeper says okay. you just happened to walk in just as he was having his heart attack. Is that true? Indeed, it is. I hadn't seen him for a while, so I picked that day to pay him a visit. I walked up to the front door, found it unlocked as usual, opened it, and there he was, lying on the floor in obvious distress. The next thing I know, his housekeeper came running in and started shrieking and carrying on, until finally I sent her out of the room so she could summon an ambulance. And I could once <laughs> Plastic? Like Toy Story? The threads are coming together. No, Best does not have any... T no one in these games has tact. They just walk up to people and are like, Yo, tell me about your dead mom. Like, guys? Not cool. Yeah. <laughs> Did you watch a man have a heart attack? Was Dr. Valet unconscious the whole time? Yes, he was. Can you remember anything that might indicate what he was doing by the front door? I mean... Had he just come in from a walk? Was he wearing a hat? Was he holding anything? Had he dropped something? An umbrella? Sunglasses? Wait a minute. Why, yes. Yes, he was holding something. A piece of paper. And on the floor next to him was an envelope. He must have collapsed while reading a letter. Um. You know what happened to it? Now, I know the letter was no longer in Bruno's hand when the paramedics arrived, so perhaps he released the letter when I moved him. And yet, I do not recall seeing it on the floor when they wheeled him out the door. Iggy. What's Iggy? Iggy. Iggy is an iguana Bruno befriended, then turned loose in his home. It soon developed the annoying habit of stealing paper and stockpiling it in the vent system. In the vent system. Why could it get into the vent system? I don't think you want iguanas in your vent system. He was holding the gun in the Are living room. I won clue. I'm so proud of you. It would not have been the first time a missing document ended up in Iggy's possession. Rene would periodically call me saying the lizard had absconded with one of Bruno's prescriptions and would I please write her up a replacement? In any case. Bruno once told me he was training Iggy. Said he taught Iggy to retrieve the things it had stolen. Okay. Do you think... Uh, I don't need to read these through like it's, it's disco. I was hoping the annoying death habit death was day. eating humans. <laughs> the pills from those missing prescriptions and giving them to him oh all at once? No. 
Had he died of an overdose of the medications I had prescribed, the manner of his death would have been quite different. But he died of a heart attack. Of that, I am certain. However, I know for a fact that Rene is deeply involved in the practice of voodoo. And as Bruno's housekeeper, she had ample opportunity to use it against my poor old friend. You mean hoodoo really works? Young lady, never, ever underestimate the power of suggestion. If a person believes in something, even on a subconscious level, fantasy can easily become fact. And who knows what rubbish Rene filled Bruno's mind with. Drink this, don't eat that, this brings good luck, that brings bad, day in and day out, even if he said he didn't believe a word of it. Who knows how much his subconscious was absorbing? He was very old and vulnerable. So could Rene have caused Bruno to have that fatal heart attack? There's not a doubt in my mind she could indeed. Okay, thank you, sir. Thanks for your time. I've enjoyed our conversation immensely. Sorry, I have to send someone a screenshot of an email for a zine thing. All right. So now let's go back to Nance. Me, you can play best in this game, roommate. In what game? Why are you in my room? It's like he doesn't appreciate me. Uh, I'm glad giving no contacts really helped JJ. I'm sure it very much helped. Um, and that's pretty much it. Good work. <laughs> I love them being like fade Thanks, to black. Man. Explain. Good luck. Bye. All right. Still have to do that. Okay, I guess we can't check things off yet. Um. Oh. All right, Iggy, where the fuck are you? Where is this goddamn iguana? Yes? I'm afraid you're going to be stuck with me for a while. Let me guess. Because of the big storm that's blowing in. Everyone in the city's freaking out and you can't get a cab. His, 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 uh, the lip sync is a little funk. she put me on hold funky. for two hours. Oh, don't worry. We've got it's not like bad, but like it's obvious when it's yes. not matching up. If that makes sense. I'll check back with you later. Whatever. Where is your iguana? Hello again. All right. I'll leave you to your God party. damn it. Take care, hon. <sighs> All right. I have to figure out how to get in the vents, basically. Um. Hmm, let's click around again, I guess. I don't know. Let's go, let's go to the rooms we've been in before and see if we can run into this little thing. Iggy! Iggy! Iguana! Iguana! <laughs> yeah, show us the iguana emo boy. Oh. What the? Oh man, is this some puzzle I don't understand? I just looked this up. This is insane. Okay, do you guys want to know what this puzzle is? Can I just, like, if I tell you, are you going to be like... Who cares? None of you are... Who have... Here's the thing. Somebody, like, submitted, like, uh, one of those surveys for me, because now I guess I get surveys, but someone submitted one the other day and said that they enjoy about me that my skill. What skill? There's no skill being used here. Anyway, I'm going to tell you how, what this actually is. That's what I was initially thinking too, Elliot. These are the ancestors you put them in order. No. So, 
Study the portraits. Note that all the portraits carry a unique item and note that the arrangement of the frames is similar to the piece of paper found in Hotchkiss's book. Using the letters in the paper, arrange the portraits. So you have to look at this and go, oh, this looks the same as this. And then you have to go, oh, T? What in here is a T? Toothbrush. How am I supposed to figure that out? How am I supposed to fi- Huh? Guys? This Nancy Drew game doesn't give you shit. It's like, no, you want to be a detective, you're going to be a real ass detective. Good luck. What starts with a B? Jesus Christ. Hat, dog, lol, banana. Oh my god. Yeah, this is definitely a harder one. F? Oh, fan. <laughs> so, M, monkey. I don't, I would never have gotten, I would never have gotten that. Like, I never in a million years would have put that together. L. They did give me Bess. They gave me Bess. So, hat. I probably could have looked at more than one at once, but I have no memory. A. P. Oh, it's a poodle. Oh, axe. Poodle. What kind of bullshit nonsense? Right? What kind of bullshit nonsense? Oh. Come on, Summer. Give me a break here. You never said anything about that. Well, how was I supposed to know? I mean, what am I, telepathic? Do we think Henry killed him? Look, I'll, I'll see what I can do. We also, so we have Henry, we have the doctor, and we have the gardener. You gotta be kidding me, Summer. I don't have that kind of money. <laughs> Did the iguana kill him? Is the iguana here? I don't know if the iguana's here. I can't move yet. Oh, man. Okay. Um. Oh. What's this? What the fuck? Oh, okay. The eye of the beholder. All right. My bet's on Henry. I'll keep that in mind. We'll have a running, a running guessing game going on. How about that? Um, but there were stairs. Can I go up them now? These are steep ass stairs. Oh, jeez. Oh, wait. This is the spider web. Oh, fuck. These have different amounts. Do you think I should write them down? <sighs> okay, hold on. I have to look through my notebooks. Okay, so I have grabbed a notebook. It's not the one I used to use for Nancy Drew Clues, but you win some, you lose some. I have a lot of notebooks. I will make do. Um, how do we do bets in Twitch? We place bets against Henry and the Iguana. Well, we can't actually, so I'll just mentally have to remember, so there's fine. Um, or maybe I actually did have a heart attack and there's no mystery. Nancy's just snooping for no reason. That would be so funny. I think that'd be so funny. How many of these are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, one, two, three, four, five, ah, six. This is hard to draw for some reason, uh, and I don't like it. Seven, eight, and then that's one, Three, two, I'm not going in order at all. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that must be eight. And then, so this key that the spider has must be, um, you know. All right, guys, I am going to go mess with that spider. So if you do not like spiders, um, I will let you know before I click it and we can, you can ignore it until I say that it's safe. Let me actually go over there. Can I grab that book? Oh, Jesus. Okay, weirdo. Um, all right, I am going to be clicking on the spider thing now. If you don't like spiders, um, it, it's, it's like, it's not a huge spider, but it is a spider and it's going to be dancing around for a sec. So, um, wait, I think I got them in the wrong order. Damn it. All right. Hold on. The spider is now gone. There is no more spider. We are in a spider free zone. So we are back and let's go back to that secret passageway. Na Nance, thank you. I miss her already. <laughs> Uh, turn around. Let's go in here. No, Nance, please, girlfriend. I'm obsessed with how many secret passages there are in Nancy Drew games. They said, oops, all secret passages. I would love a secret passage. Oh! All right. Um... What the fuck? Whoa. I thought this- one of those bookshelves is a secret- Yeah, I figured one of those bookshelves was a secret passage, but I didn't know- Oh, there's an eye? Then we definitely have to get all the eyes, don't we? Sorry, this is going to take a sec. I will say this doesn't have great aim, so... Oh! Oh, you want a secret bookshelf passage. Yeah, no, that's fair. I have always wanted one, too. I think they're cool. Is anyone else bored yet? <laughs> no! No! Fuck me! Okay. This is a little nightmarish. Um, I wonder if the puzzle is supposed to represent the actual thing going on with gambling? Is that the twist secret gambling basement? Maybe? I don't know. I, I, I'm so beyond knowing what's in going on in this game. <laughs> Shit. Is this the this is the Borscht Bolt Club? <laughs> yeah, you go down the basement, you see this shit. God damn it. Okay, if I go all the way to the right or left at full speed, it will go into the center. If I go half speed. Like, why can't she just walk, climb up it and fuck? Why can't she just climb up it and change it herself with her hands? 
What if Kristoff killed a man because he beat him at this? <laughs> what if, Ronnie? You're right. What if? At Nancy Drew Skiba. <laughs> This is so annoying. Ah, oh, fuck. I want to cry. <laughs> ah! Okay, um, I was just reading to see if the, um, the wiki, the, 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 the walkthrough had any advice, and it doesn't. They're just like, throw it a bunch and see what happens. Fuck you guys. Nancy girl, don't be above cheating. Literally, do not be above cheating. We are not above cheating in this household. Fuck me. You've got to be fucking with me. It feels like there's not a ton of, like, control over this. Oh my god. I'm convinced these mini games are all unbeatable to sell. Are in here to be unbeatable to sell walkthroughs, old walkthrough books. Maybe. No. Okay. Then I think I have to go the other side. Okay, but now we have to go a little further to get that fucking chicken. No. Oh, no, I did that at an angle. Oh, it's okay, okay. Let's go a little bit, pull back a little more. <laughs> Hello, Cloak Sword 117. Welcome to me being really bad at skee-ball. I don't understand. God, the worst part is it takes two hits to get back to the eye. It really is, huh? Let's go. Fuck yes, okay. You bitch. Oh my god. This is the worst. What is it even hitting on? Why not? Might as well, right? Okay, but now I have to get the middle... Okay, hold on. No! This is the worst mini game. <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying that. I feel like I say that like four times a playthrough. No! Okay, there we go. Oh my. I'm taking deep, controlled breaths right now. I think how good you'll feel when you finally beat it. Yeah, well, I just fucked it. <laughs> okay, one. No. I don't understand what I'm doing. My god. Yeah, this is... Okay, cool, cool. 
Not cool. Yeah, it's... It's difficult to parse. That's for sure. <laughs> I read that in Professor Layton's voice. <sighs> I need to control myself. I need to control myself. I need to take a deep breath. I need to channel my inner gentleman and not hit my death hand rage. <sighs> Fuck me running. It's fine. It's fine. We are losing progress. We are rapidly losing progress. <laughs> okay. I think if I pull all the way back, it'll automatically hit something. There we go. Okay. A gentleman does not destroy puzzles simply because they are difficult. <laughs> I am trying to get the eyes because the guy has... Um, a thing about eyes. You know? You just got a thing for eyes. So that's why we are attempting- Shit! We are attempting to get all of them to eyes. Are you serious? I think sometimes this is so temper- like, this is like really finicky. This is very, like, it's almost too exact. Because- oh my god! I'm just going to take a moment, take a few deep breaths, and just... <sighs> this shit is... <laughs> Fuck, man! Fuck! <laughs> It's like the game is laughing at me. <laughs> it's, um... Okay. <laughs> I don't know why they thought some of this would be fun. Woo! It's like, um, a little bit too much like real ski ball where, like, just shifting things the tiniest bit will change everything, every single time. On one hand, I feel bad for you, Taya. On the other hand, <laughs> a shitty day. What? I'm glad you're having a fun time, Elliot. I'm glad I could make you feel a little better. Because, um... Wow. Wow. Okay. Now I have to figure out this again. Nope, nope, nope. Did that wrong. I didn't mean to hit whatever. Whatever. Oh, okay. So that needs to be... Okay, well. This is fine. Of course it comes back to an eye as soon as I mix, mix it up. Oh my god. Um, that way and that way. Um, so it's mouths, eyes, and rooster is the three most mysterious body parts. Uh, you know. No, that was the wrong direction. What? Did I not pull it hard enough? Whatever. Okay, if I... Oh, fuck. What? How necessary is this for, to me solving this game? How necessary is this puzzle? Is this one of the necessary Nancy Drew puzzles? Hmm. Are you kidding me? Okay. 
Hold on a second. Okay. Nope. I thought I was doing this the same way each time, but clearly I am not. So, how was everyone's day? How, how are we all feeling? Oh, hey! Okay. Um, just be careful now. Okay. That's how hard it takes to get to the back. We are learning. Oh, you went kayaking? Kayaking is fun. I would love to go kayaking. Um, I need the exercise. Well, I live in Canada, so it was a normal Monday here. Oh my god. Uh, I hope your day was... Well, you said you had a bad day. <laughs> well, I hope it's better tomorrow. Um, mine was good because I almost got my entire rough lines from a stand animat gun. Congrats! Good luck. I'm excited to see it. This is... This is hell. Oh my god! I'm so sick of these teeth and eyes and roosters. I would have gotten the whole thing done, but I have art. Oh, right, 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 for deadlines. I have a lot of art I have to do tomorrow. I have a lot of writing I have to do tomorrow. I have to post before bed tonight. Oh, I have to pull all the way for the middle one. I'm at the part I didn't script anything for. So valid, Ronnie. Is this thing on like a weird angle or something? It feels like when I'm pulling completely straight, it doesn't actually go straight. Um. Okay, okay, okay. Dude. Okay. Whatever. Sorry, I just had to be silent for a second. Thank God! Oh my God. <laughs> this is so <laughs> ridiculous. So did we get anything? Are you kidding me? These better be worth something. This better be better need this. <laughs> oh my god. I think someone said we needed them, so that's fine. This must be where I'm supposed okay, to Okay, yes, we do need them. Okay. Let's see how we're doing. That glass eyeball has a has pink eye. Yeah, tell me again about it. Oh. They They're all gonna have to look in different directions? Can I not put these in? Oh, or is are these my eyeballs that I've collected? Those must be the eyeballs I've collected. Uh, yeah, I do need a bunch more anyways, you're right. Ah! Fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay. Shit. Hold on. Let me write these down. Let me write these down real quick. C. 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 D. Ah! E. Sorry, I hit my mic stand.
Okay, so I'll need to take that back. Yeah, she's back! I'll have to take that back to that section. Will you give me an eyeball? Nope, that's not what I want. Do I have to eat all of these? I know there's an eyeball in here. I can feel it in my bones. I'm gonna make Nancy eat so much gum. Is there an eyeball in here? <laughs> or am I just wasting time? Nancy's gonna get diabetes. Alright, we'll go back to that later. Okay, well, no, I wanted to... No, I can't see the stuff behind these. All right. Um. Oh. 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 That's why we could see that door. Okay, well. That, now we have to go downstairs. Again. No, get away from the weird cemetery, Nance. Uh, not actually sure, but that would be funny. Yeah, I haven't had an instant death yet. Oh, wait, that's, that's, I should save. Save moment. Local newspaper headline, Teen Sleuth dies from gum overdose. I know, that would be just like her, huh? Would just be, would be just like our Nancy. Oh my. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> that was really bad. Hi. Go away, Carter. <laughs> that was awful. That was really bad. Oh my god. I hated- I hated all of that. But I do have to tell you we have to do it again. So... Arg Shadow. Iridescent Pearl West Bay. Scuttled Bones Rampart Jumain. Davy Jones Beverly Knoll. Bridge Rats Indiana- Indian Beach. Kraken Parlor House. Fox a vast ye okay um short stories for tired eyes i'm not gonna read all of these i'm just gonna click through to activate any oh hold on no nance get back oh did we take it yes let's get back in there something was ripped also teeth poster Hi, Maya. Hi, is my best friend here? Yeah, Ronnie's here. Hi, best friend. <laughs> there, there might be a lag. Oh my god, I clicked through too much again. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Ronnie says hi. Yes. Um, keys to statues. The cat statues are the key. Oh, yeah. oh no, these are all... Oh no. <sighs> okay, these are all clues, aren't they? So, like, filled upper right second molar. Like, these are all things I have to know to, like, get in the bookcase, right? These are the books I have to click in that order, right? That's the order I have to click the books in. And then, in a place where bones are buried, so is something to you seek. Start where Charlie Wicker sleeps, tread lightly on the ground that sinks and sleeps. Charlie will give you directions. But count on my shovel to find the way when you find the place of mental task. Okay. Avian statues hides you around mechanical feathers from... Oh, okay. So I have to get them to there. I have to get them to that position on that weird thing. So long live this octopus. All right. This dude was a little too into teeth and eyes. Yeah, a little bit. 
On this day, November 8th, 1952, the Jolly Rancher crew of New Orleans hereby invites Dr. Bruno Sinclair Boulay to join its hallowed ranks. Speak of this to no one save the man who has championed you and will, should you expect, accept this invitation, serve as your sponsor during initiation process, Dr. Gilbert Boothard. Welcome. So, I have to definitely call up. Oh! Bruno, as usual, a good time was had by all your friend and fellow Jolly Roger Gilbert. So Bess has to come back. Oh. I don't know how this works. Hold on. What the fuck? I want... I see an eyeball if... Yeah, I just am trying to get it. I don't know what this button does. I don't understand it yet. Hold on, let me figure this out. Um, ah. Fuck, okay. I missed it. And it's gonna go up to here. Gotcha. Got it! Jeez, timing now. Um... I can't take those. There must be another way out. Oh. So I just can't. How did I get out before? Oh. Great. The way I got lost in a tiny room. Unbelievable. Um. Oh, it was there. There we go. Okay. I was like, why can I not get out of here? Oh no, it's going to bite you. I'm good. Don't worry. So, hold on. Let me save. I feel like I know too much now. Like, I didn't know anything before, and now I know too much. Um. Sorry, I have the hiccups. Okay, that's what I needed to do. I um, have that stupid fucking doll. So we need to... <sighs> okay. Um, I'm back what I missed. I have fudge ice cream. Oh, um, me trying to grab an eyeball. Uh, nothing special. This pen sucks. Um. Nah, sorry, I'm copying down the symbols. This is why my very first Nancy Drew play playthrough wasn't very fun for any to want to watch because I had to I was taking notes and um taking notes is not interesting it's not interesting to hear it's not interesting it might be a little bit more interesting maybe if you're watching <laughs> like if you if I had a video feed but I don't want to do that um although I am considering like making like maybe 2000 or something be like um fake cam so if a fake comes in you can redeem it and i will turn on my camera very briefly to show fay maybe um i will drink some i will take multiple sips of my drink thank you elliot thank you ronnie okay um, ba, za, lu, pa, d, mu. Uh, ka. 
Okay. Oh man, they're doing fireworks fine literally across the street from me. I was wondering why that was so Oh god, I'm so sorry. Okay. We are gonna do this fucking dummy thing so we don't have to think about it later, guys. Cause I don't I don't want to interact with that dummy more than I need to. <laughs> Hiccups. Ugh, terrible. All right, you guys ready? Because I'm not. Oh, <sighs> okay. Ba. Za. Lu. Pa. Di. Mu. Ka. Did I... Did I not do that right? Oh, I didn't, I did hold on. Oh, there's a talk button on the side. Oh, okay, hold on. Ba, za, lu, pa, ti, mu, ka. Oh god. Oh god. Last Denzian buried on my guard will start your you a hunting through the graveyard. What's written on the headstone will lead you to another and so on and so forth till tiny treasure you discover. Why can I type something here? Oh my god, get me away. Okay, remember the horse from the Danny Gonzalez video? It could be worse. You could be the horse. You could be playing the horse game right now. Ugh. No, uh, JJ, I think I'm supposed to fill it in with an answer, not my name. Um, I now have money. It makes no sense why this would do this, but I will take it. No, it's yours. You now claim it. Oh, okay, got it. How many do I have? Ugh, not enough. Yeah. Mm hmm. That's what I was thinking. I forgot I need to click that. Downstairs. Yeah. Um. Do I call best now? Wait a minute. Oh my god. Okay. This is going to be the clock then. Because I was going to do the teeth books, but this is going to be the clock. So, so midday is in 12 noon. What time will it be at? Three hours have passed. Um, then... Let's pretend that's, that it's that time and move ahead two hours more. And then from from there, let's say it's nine hours before. No. If six hours before then, we make note of time. What time would we be if we moved ahead nine? I don't know if I did that right. Okay. At exactly midday, the teacher said to his class, what time, so that's noon, what time will it be when three hours have passed? That's three. Let's pretend that it's time and move two hours more. That's five. Then let's say it's nine hours before. So that's five. So four, so that should be eight. I messed that up. Um, if six hours before then, we made note of the time, so that's two. You good? 
Okay. And what time would it be if we moved ahead nine? So that's 11. And that's part one. Goodbye, Elliot. I will talk to you later. I hope you have a better day tomorrow. Sleep well. Uh, what time? Oh, wait, that's in part two. At high noon, the sheriff stepped into the street and dressed bad man fart. So that's 12. Five hours ago, I told you to leave town and you, okay, five hours ago. So that would be seven. I told you to leave town and you said you'd be gone in three. So that's 10. Uh, there are a reason why you're still here. I left right when I said I would, Bart exclaimed, but just as I was riding out my horse through his shoe, I took him straight to the blacksmith, but he was real busy. He said it would be five hours till he was finished with my horse. So that would be three. Um, better tell him to get a move on because two hours from now, if you're still here, you're going to be real sorry, I understand. So that's five. Oh, wait, no, no, no. It's noon. So that's two o'clock. Uh, Bart understood he went back to the back so that an hour later he was on his way out of town so that it was one o'clock. Okay, uh, part three. It was midnight on a dark and stormy night. So we're starting at noon again. At 12 again, sorry. Um, only four hours before I had seen my dear friend Hollis. So four hours before 12 is eight. And who informed me he was leaving for the court of the Star Chamber in a mere two hours and feared he would never return. 10. I realized that six after, hours after he was to enter the chamber. So, four. I was to surrender myself to Count Blackburn. I had no way of knowing whether after the usual five hours, so nine, of interrogation i would be able to keep my rendezvous with lucretia two hours later 11. would the count let me leave or would he imprison me forever i was terrified this is an insane way to hide something and also uh, i hope that was super interesting to you so 12. do i click the eyeball each time do you think Okay. Eyeball. Okay, 12. 7. 10. clock has been completed okay so god there's a lot of fucking eyeballs to find all right let's see 
Um, is it gonna be the top one or the bottom one, do you think? Okay, a uh, librarian's tale. So this is probably the top one, right? Because the second one has. See, that's magic spit to keep stuck in the eye. You must time to look at the cards to keep track of every book, the title's a thing, in addition to the hook that will let you remove the orb from its no. This no. It's. It, bleh, bleh. Well, you know what they say beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Somebody. They already made that joke with the, one of the books. The JJ. <laughs> Um, hold on, um, burp, burp, burp. yeah, they already made a joke about the, about the, with the, you know, Actually, that was last one. what are you talking about? Yeah. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> um, um. Okay, what does the clue say? Uh, time will tell. We've done a library- a great- A uh, great keeper of books. Uh, true am I. Many a reader through- Many a reader through me can spy on wondrous worlds that never die. You could say it's magic, the librarian's eye. But for such an eye, you must first take a look. The cards they keep at track of- each book. The title's a thing, the addition's the hook. That will let you remove the orb from this nook. Um. Okay. Um, I don't understand this one yet, so hold on. Um. <laughs> yeah, there's the Eye of the Hold Beholder book. Um. Yeah, sorry, JJ, you are derivative. Um... A librarian's tale. Oh. Something Bruno Bollet wrote in that Tired Eyes book mentioned the librarian's eye. Maybe it has something to do with the ones that have eyes. Uh. Take notes, hold on. numbers and I've never added something up before in this game in these games so let me do some math so that's 10 that's 10 that's 20 zero two that's four that's 10 that's 15 okay that was like the worst way to do math ever When? Ugh, I can't believe how much of this game's finding eyeballs. Okay. All right, next up. You guys having fun? 
This, I will admit this game is a lot less mini games and more actually solving things, which I guess is nice. So, okay. So, uh, upper right, so upper right second. Um, oh no. Holy shit, hi Tay, I accidentally took a nap. Well, you had a long night last night, so I hope you're feeling better, Hannah. Um, I hope you're feeling a little more alive. Uh, it's less mini games, but a huge percent of game with skee-ball. <laughs> you make a point, JJ. You do make a point. Um, upper left, central incisor. Filled lower left, cent lateral incisor. Instead of going back to that room and looking for a guide, I am just going to look up a thing for teeth myself. Upper left. First. That's pied, and then. Lower left canine and then lower left third molar. Okay, give me a second while I look up uh, teeth, I guess. I'm gonna look up teeth. I'm also gonna save. Saving is good. Saving is always good. Um, I'm feeling sleepy. We'll see if I can sleep tonight. Well, I hope you can sleep tonight. If you can't, that would stink. Nope, too far. Nope, not far enough. Just kidding, just kidding. Alright. So, let me pull this up. So some of these are baby teeth and some of these are adult teeth. So give me a second. Because that's deeply confusing. Um, and I, I need to figure this out, so. Um, center incisor is a baby tooth. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, let me see if I got this. One, two. Oh, okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Uh, okay. Was that all? Was that all? I just realized Hannah missed the puppet. Well, maybe that's for the best. I think that's for the best, to be honest. Because it sucked. It sucked. Hannah, be glad you missed the puppet. If you're so desperate to see it, you can go back into the VOD. Do you think I could borrow your keychain? The one that has Bruno's glass eye on it. You want to borrow it? What for? Actually, all I really want is the eye. I mean, it's just so cool. What if you break it? I won't. I'll be really careful. I promise. Uh, I a very freaky kids. puppet. Sorry. A scary puppet that chanted various syllables at you and was very scary. The box of your great uncle's things that you sold to Zeke's curio shop. That was a no-no, wasn't it? What box of things? I don't know what you're talking about. The 
guy who owns the shop said you sold him a box of assorted items. I am assuming they used to be Bruno's. Well, somebody screwed up somewhere because I haven't sold anything to anybody. Why would I sell one lousy box of stuff when I'm about to inherit a whole house full of stuff? Get real. You sold it because you needed some This guy is in order to keep so annoying. How do you know about her? Right? He's very the annoying. I think he's annoying. Nancy is not getting paid for this. No, there's technically like he doesn't even really want her staying around for the mystery. She's just very deeply nosy. So there is no reason for her. Is she unpredictable? I never know what's gonna make her happy. Like just before I left. Okay. Not not to be this person, but like he <laughs> he he is wearing a single mesh glove with no fingers. She calls and says her sound system just went bluey, and I had to buy her a new one because what good were the CDs? So once she has a hold on a mystery, only death scream will stop her. I don't even know if the death scream stops her. It just like mildly inconveniences her. I wired her the money, but then she called and said she also needed new headphones. My guy, I think she just wants the money. I think she realizes she's not going to get much out of this relationship. When so I try to talk to her about always wanting more like that, she gets really mad. But I'm afraid if I don't give her what she wants, she'll break up with you. My guy, that doesn't sound good. I think you should maybe just She's take the, the L on this one. Had, ever will have, probably. Look, you don't need to go telling Renee or any of those lawyers about selling that stuff, right? I guess I could just forget all mm. about it. Especially if you were to, say, do something for me. I know. You still want the glass eye? Take it. Go ahead. It's all yours. You want something, I want something, take it and we're even, okay? Well, it's not like you sold off half the estate or anything. 300 bucks. That's all I've gotten out of his estate. I swear. Go on, take it. Okay. Oh, okay. That's... I was naughty, but from now on I'll be nice. I promise. All right. Do you know anything? Uh, about the yes, blackmail. I love a blackmail. There wasn't any crystal skull in that box. Are you sure? It we love blackmail. Well, I did throw in some smaller boxes. Like I said, I was just grabbing stuff. Was it valuable? All I really know for sure right now is that it's missing. Great. Be just my luck to have sold something that wasn't junk to that glorified trash collector okay I'll let you get back to work awesome okay um let's save again since we just had a conversation hello again that shovel over there with the interest <sighs> do you think I could borrow it I feel like we've gotten a lot done tonight I feel like that's don't know why yes used it just like to see it hanging there. Me, I use it to dig up roots. You mean like tree roots? No, I mean roots like tannus, black cohosh, valerian. Roots that in the right hands are very special. Very powerful. However, right now I need mushrooms. I was hoping to get them picked tonight, but from the looks of all this potting I still have to do, What do you need mushrooms for? Dried and crushed, they comprise the main ingredients in one of my tonics. Tell you what, I need five painted conks. They're mushrooms that have got a short, fat stem and a large, bell-shaped cap covered with big red dots. You might find one or two here in the garden, but you'll have better luck in the boggy part of the cemetery. You get me five, no more, no less, and I'll let you borrow that shovel. Okay. Deal. You can put them in this bag. All right. I guess we are now. Oh, it's like twenty eyes. Is it? It's like fifteen. We that still have ten left. Service to you. But Believe that is a lot. Body. Okay. Come I need five of these. Well, I've definitely seen these weird mushrooms around. So, because I was noting this how. These look poisonous. Am I wrong? Or do these look poisonous? Okay. 
Um, sorry, I'm just making sure I get all of them from this area. There's a, definitely one down here, though. If I there we go. Another painted cop. Yes. These look disgusting. Okay. Um. I know there was one by the like lakey thing. Um. I think it's down here. Yes. There we go. Okay. Oh. Oh my god. It, it. Okay. Oh, there was an alligator in the little cemetery, like, thingy. Do you remember the cemetery model? Um. Uh, I know there are more around here, but I don't know how to get there. I don't know how to get there, so we're gonna have to just walk mindlessly, I guess. Okay, not there. Love the trumpets. Again, rolling vibes. I think that's because every time I see an alligator in games, I think of her. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Um, how many do I have? How, how many? Four. Okay. I need to find one more. Okay. Uh, one more mushroom. Uno mas can't remember the word for mushroom. Not that way. Not that way. That way? Shit. Oh no. Fuck. Oh, listen, I know, like, the main things in every game, and that's all that matters, okay? I know the main things in everywhere, and that's- oh my god, where is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's fine, don't worry about it. Well, here's the thing. I have give, been given sure the did. entire when summary of AAI2, and it's you been a hot second since I looked at it. I vaguely remember there. being told about oh an alligator by my friend who gave me this whole summary. However, I did not get names for many of the characters. She just kind of gave archetypes um, instead of giving me names, so... Like, while I can be like, okay, I kind of know what you're talking about with an alligator, I can't, I would not be able to, like, name any of the characters because no one told me them. I, like, know the characters that are reoccurring and then a few of the other ones, but not, um, not one-offs. Not one-offs for sure. Miriam was kind of just like, okay, here's everything that happened. And I was like, okay. But it was also a very long time ago, and I care, took hun. the broadest strokes to commit to memory, and if I need more, I literally just, like, look, go back and look at it again, because I'm just like, okay, sure. Um, do I have anything to talk to you about, dude? Yes. Nope. I'll check back with you later.
Hello again. I'll leave you to okay. your Okay. Oh, I need to do Come the spider anytime. thing again. I don't know if there's a spider in here, so there might be a spider. Warning, there may be a spider. You've been warned. There's no spider, it's fine. Okay, so let's find middle C. Okay, that's middle C. Uh, does it go up? That's high C, so C. Is this D? D, E, F, G, A, A, B, C. Okay, hold on. Remember that light hope quote we loved? Apologies, I made more spiders. Yes. Yes, I do. So, C, 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 um, D, How would this even work as something like that has a mechanism in it? Is it sound? Like is there like a thing that's con that like listens? I don't know, it doesn't make much sense. Okay. Let's check some shit off. I haven't done that. Check. Jack. Jack. Did that. Jack. Jack. I haven't done that. Jack. Did that. All done. All done. Still have to do that. I haven't done that. Jack. All done. All done. Jack. Still have to do that. Did that. Did that. Did that. I haven't done that. All done. All done. I haven't done that. Oh, I didn't take the shovel? Oops, that's on me. There we go. Um. The last Denzian buried in on my guard will start you on a hunt in through the graveyard. What's written on the headstone will lead you to another, and so on and so forth. Tiny treasure you discover. So, the last one, which means we should check the... Nope. Just check over here. Um, uh, so that's Tierra Sesta. T siesta. Oh my god. Terra Siesta. Is Sorrow Park Slumber Guard so Terra Siesta? Um, I did have to type in here. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Um, what's her name? Tammy, Tammy, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hi, guy. Tammy Tasselman. That looks like the right name. Okay, but what do I do now? Do I have to visit that? All right, let's fucking go find Terra Siesta. Let's go walk in the rain some more.
that's too far. I think it's this way. Up here. Yeah, Terra Siesta. Um, okay, cool. She couldn't, uh, couldn't sleep without a peep, so when she died, we buried her deep. Couldn't sleep without a peep, so when she died, we buried her deep. What the fuck does that mean? What the- Okay, let's just go back and see if it's in the book, I guess. That would make sense, right? What a fucked up thing to put on a grave. I know! Nance, can we not just take this fucking book outside so we don't have to do this? When she died, she couldn't sleep without a peep. So when she died, we buried her deep. I don't understand how we would even... How... Without a peep. She couldn't sleep without a peep. So when she died, we buried her deep. I'm trying to get to the beginning. I don't know why, like, deep, like, the first one. No, Nancy has to do this with the book right here, right now. Okay, um... Without a peep. So when she died, we she died, we buried her deep. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, sure. No, I... Am I not understanding this clue? Like, am I fundamentally misunderstanding it? She couldn't sleep without a peep. So when she died, we buried her deep. Well, those are above ground. Mausoleums are above ground. I mean, all of these look to be above ground. I don't understand. Sleeping Meadow? But even then, there's so many names in this book, right? Like, there's so many names. Like, how do you know who it is? Do you try all of them? Like, um, oh, I hate, hate us. Hold on, I'm looking it up. Oh fuck, I forgot this one website. You have to like highlight it. But since I'm on my phone, I have to highlight it and then copy paste it into a note. Check out page 79 and name, sound out the names out loud. Val Haskell, no wait, 79. Jimmy Manny. Gil Lee Melville, Greg T. Odell, Alfred Burnow, Evander Tristan, 
Edder, Edgar Grossvenner, Grossvenner, constant snoring, constant snoring, constant snoring. Is this fucking Ace Attorney? They, re they, they really wanted us to go through all of the names in this book and figure out which one was the Ace Attorney name. That's what we're doing. Oh my god. Constance. <sighs> Noring. Next time I need to come up with an Ace Attorney character, I'm not even going to come up with one. I'm just going to use Constance Noring. They're just going to, you guys are just going to have to deal with it. And like, you like six people, you guys will know. That's gotta be. You guys will just know. You will just know Constance Snor Noring. Constance Noring is going to show up. She's going to be in my one case fic. I can feel it. She's going to be, have been asleep the whole time. And a, and it, and, and a, <laughs> And, and a major plot point is going to be that <laughs> someone, like, they, there had to have been, like, the, her snoring has to be, like, an, like a, it turns the case around, okay? Like, it just has to be. Um, I have to go find her. She was in the crypt. Um, all right. Uh. Add this to your blackmail pile. Your fucking theft. What? I, do, I, Ronnie, I don't even know what you're talking about. My brain has melted out of my ears. It's true. It's gone now. It's gone. No brain. Okay, this is 40 Winks Mausoleum, which isn't what I want. What? What? <laughs> I no longer know what's happening. <laughs> no. No, my brain's not okay. This Nancy Drew game has too many puzzles. Man, I need to fucking to sleep, but I'm fucking invested in this. I need to know her. I need to know the case. I need it. Well, I'll I'll figure it out and let you know, Hannah. Um, I will not be going much longer, JJ, if that helps. I think I'm going to do 10 more minutes. Yeah, she's having a camel meal moment. Uh, never early, never late. Never early, never late. Do you guys think this is another Ace Attorney name? If it is, they will also be appearing. They will, <laughs> girl, <laughs> learn. If this is the case, she will, all, the, these folks will also be appearing. Uh, uh, Jimmy Manny, Gilly, Melville. Edgar Gross for constant snoring, Driscoll, Sandy Near, Jared Fitzroy, Dale Boris Selig, Antonio D. Cyberg, Kirk G. Kirkpatrick, Gilbert Baudelio, Lorenzo Felix, Claude ya Yakov, Derek's Dexter, Nar Nar Narcis, nah, Shaquille Nar Narciso, Reef Radcliffe, Ozzy Eustache, Vivian Hayden, Wilson V. Uh, Mastislav, I don't know, Austin P. Kennedy, Coity Fre Freeman, J.T. Ritzroy. These don't feel like real names, <laughs> but maybe it's because I'm reading them all quickly. Dan Robert Merle, Damian Drummer, Derek Lincoln, Ernie Farley, Franziskes August, Godfred Sid, Denver Fraser, Caesar, Percy, Leslie, Red, Bud, Travers, Tyler, Clark, Jared, Clayton, Bart, Clyde, Tarek, Trevlin, Walt, Sky, Ulysses, Tyson, T Tennyson, London, Darby, Fletcher, Erwin, Sherlock, Sherlock, Lovell, Benjamin, Chucharonin, Zla, Paxton, Autumn, Paxton, Doug, Carl, Oshaw, Holly Wicker, Bart, Stevens, Derek, Grant, Michael, Stevens, Van, Wilson, Patrick, Reed, Wilson, Dale, Wilson, Huh. Wilson Smith, Smith Thomas, Pablo Fraser, Jamie Phillips, Phipps, Phipps, Murray, Samson, Bernard, Sparrow, Woodrow, Dinner, Danny, Felix, Octavia. There's so many names. North Stenson, Rock, Just in Time. Just in Time. It is another Ace Attorney name. 
Just in time. Constant snoring and just in time. That looks like the right name. Okay, where are you, Justin? Sorrow Park. Okay, where's Sorrow Park? Uh, okay, so I should exit. Ooh, get away from that tree. Uh, oh, Jesus. So exit. And then take a right. And then... Oh, I have to get to the twisties. Okay. This is literally the worst way to do anything because she's like running back and forth. And this is a one night case, kind of like the German one. So she has been sprinting around this graveyard, just going absolutely crazy. Sorrow Park, my brain after midnight. Oh. No, that's Slumber Gardens. Tear, tear a siesta. Oh no. I thought I did this right. Did I go in the wrong way? Shit. I think I went the wrong way. Alright, let's find this place. Maybe it's up here. No, it's crowing crypts. Uh. Uh. Writhing roots. Uh, Sorrow Park! Do you have to go through another place, possibly? All dressed up with no place to go. <sighs> um, gonna save. We love saving. We're gonna come out of here with 18 more Ace Attorney OCs than I came in here with. And I already have quite a few. I'm kidding. I have three. Ronnie knows. I talk about them a little too much. Not even that much. Just stupid shit. You guys have seen some of it. The, 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 the band OCs. They're stupid. They're stupid. Um, all dressed up with no place to go. No place to go. All right, well, I don't think it's any that I've read so far because nothing else stuck out as, like, um, a pun name. So I think we're okay for now. Sammy Luella, L Ricardo Cornell, Loop God Gobbert, Kurt Wilson, Hale Lu Lacey, Guru Nevada. Bernard Chase, Corolla Donald, Annie Franny, Kneel Down. <laughs> Jessica Kwan. <laughs> yeah, Neil Down is in here. Um, Madeline Adelia, Adonia Madison, Katie Lacia, Tegan Alberta, Manny Kin. Manny Kin! It's Manny Kin. It's gotta be Manny Kin, right? All dressed up, nowhere to go. Is that how you spell it? <laughs> I'm no dummy. Nance, girl, shut up. He's in Writhing Roots Memorial. Okay. All right, I am not getting around this cemetery any easier. But let's fucking go. Nope, that is Terra Siesta. Is this one it? That's Slumber Gardens. God damn it. I thought I I thought it was around here is the thing. That's what confused me. Forty winks. Crowing crap. Jesus Christ. Sleeping Meadow. Nancy girl, you're soaked. I know this. You're soaked to the bone. You've got to get you out of here.
Okay, what the fuck? <laughs> the next case is when Nancy dies of pneumonia. Okay, there we go. Writhing roots. Died in death. Well, let's not kneel down. Unfortunately. Our good friend, kneel down. The unfortunate thing is all of these guys are already dead, so it'll be a little bit more difficult to choose a murder victim. Died in death. Alright. Abigail Elise, Susie Yesenia, Veronica Wilson, Rafaela Marilyn, Jacqueline Jacqueline, <laughs> Rose Winterspring, Laurella Swerina, Belinda. After I find this name, we're going to be done, but um, I'm going to find the name and then we'll remember we have to go find it next week. Uh, what kind of tea, though? British black tea? Um, Honestly, I do drink a lot of like English breakfast. Um, other than that, I really like mint tea. I really like chai. Um, and then I try lots of other teas. I don't have like favorites though. I like Earl Grey. I like Earl Grey. Also, welcome, Abominable Snowman41. Hello. Um, Belinda, Lena Marquita, Carmen Smith, Lexi Nernesta. English breakfast and Earl Grey for me 100%. Good choices. Mariana Harriet, Lucy Brown, Francisca, Marilina, Ludacris. <laughs> Ludacris. Yeah, okay, write that one down too, guys. Ludacris. I'm a simple man. I see Nancy Drew. I click. I, I'm i going to say I love Nancy Drew and then everyone's going to yell at me, but I do love Nancy Drew. Um, Maramain, Connie Chuckle, Juliet Penn, Zivit, Sunday. Jolene, Joni, Lucille Christie, Trix Kingsley, Marzena Celestina. I keep thinking you're about to say Francisca von Karma. She's in here. Little do you know, she's in this game. She is dead, but she's in this game. Melina Hanna, Dolly Ray, Dirk Greaser, Betty Barnchaser, Diane Evelyn, Nikki Gwendolyn, Isabel Justin, Justine, Darian Uella, Tricia Pia, Daniela, Alberta, Ukulele. Ukulele, ukulele. That's that might be one. That might be one. Right? Um, Lainey, Lilling, Debbie, Sal, Zoe, uh, Pass, Jonathan, uh, Reagan, Jean, Paris, Louis. K Healy, Meryl, really, Missy, Felicia, Ray Carson, Pia Delphians, Juan, Wanda, Pan, and then Nora, Blilla, Jared, Luz, Tanya, Josetta, Maureen, Jocelyn, Hera, Hillary, Sherilyn, Bush, Jolene, Steffi, Bayou, Horda, Donna, Madeline, I'm sorry, there's so many names in here. They really gave you the most names. Toya Wilson, Aura B. Antonia, Christine Nerede, Jane Addy, Amanda Jada, Jose Christie, Aishwara Nilam. Ah! Ah! There's so many names. Um. Okay, 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 okay. Back to the beginning. It is very good. And you really have to, yeah, you have to say a lot of them out loud just to check. I don't know. They gave us, there's too many in here. You could argue there's way too many names in this book. Okay, Peter P, Connor, Zed Benton, Fraser Modest, Robert Daniel, Sheldon J, Fernando Resumes, and Levi Roy. Cassian Martinez, Amando Cyril, Josiah Beck, Teobaldo, Ricky Collin, Garrett Quincy, Owen Moore, Owen Moore, Owen Moore, Owen Moore, Owen Moore. That looks like the right name. All right, well, that is how many names I'm going to find today. And these are going to be my new OCs. So let's give it up for Constance Noring. Just in Time, Mannequin, Owen Moore. Uh, who else was there? 
kneel down. Um, Yuke I have no idea how that one's supposed to be even pronounced. And I think there was maybe one more, but <laughs> meet my new crew. This is these are my new guys. These are my Blorbos. <laughs> I hope you like them. Um, thank you so much to everyone for coming today. I guess I had fun. Oh, it was ludicrous. It was <laughs> it was ludicrous. You're welcome. You're right. Thank you. Thank you. It was ludicrous. Um, <laughs> thanks for coming, even though I was a little unsure if I was going to stream today. If you had a holiday, I hope you had a nice holiday. If you had a, just a day, I hope you had a nice day. I will see you again on Thursday if you come watch me play Disco Elysium. If not, I will see you next Monday. I do not think I will have time for any random streams this week just because I am writing a lot and stuff. Um, but yes, I'll see you next week for hopefully more of Legend of the Crystal Skull so we can find more guys. We will find more guys. We will develop this murder and figure it out. So thank you so much for coming and I will see you all next week. Bye-bye.